One, two, three, let's do it. Three years ago, FAO Schwartz closed its doors. People were devastated, especially New Yorkers. And that's what makes today so exciting. Today, we're making history. FAO Schwartz is back in New York City. This is a store that is going to have unique products and experiences that can't be found anywhere else. This FAO Schwartz store will be better than ever before, and it will be here to stay. I think one of the big differences between the 2015 stores, we're in a position now where we've created a lot more FAO Schwartz product that's really great product, beautifully packaged, and also great value that's very accessible in price point for everybody and every price point. Dance on Piano is back, the Clock Tower is back, and I would just say just the general enthusiasm, the demonstrators, the great staff that's here, that's here to create memories with you and your family. No, this will be a New York experience. We are announced that we're opening a new store in Beijing, China next year, so we're going global. And then we have shop and shops with FAO product in a variety of stores across the United States. I think people are really clamoring for it to come back. And we heard from so many people that FAO was a part of their childhood. And they, 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 New York wasn't New York without FAO Shores. It's awesome! The kids love it. They're having tons of fun just checking out all the toys and experiencing all the toys, actually. Chemical reactions, I should say. And all the stuff that you can actually buy in the stores, pharmacies, or. It was like the movie Big. It's like to be Tom Hanks, <laughs> and it was wonderful. It's like amazing because like you have like all the toys here that you can buy in other stores, but it's like all in one store. Like it's smushed together.